up to go and I'm gonna hit the road tonight Now my wheels in motion and my Well, you couldn't find reverse. <laughs> Keep going. Oh, I think he lives here. He's going to the hardware store. Clean yourself up. I oh, know. No makeup on. No makeup, no nothing. Well, this, this is absolutely beautiful, though. Oh, wait till you see the views here in a sec, guys. <laughs> you won't hear much from Kimmy. She'll be concentrating back there. I'm concentrating, yes. <laughs> Going around the side of a mountain. <laughs> you don't like the people that come with it. Which people? That's you, look. Our lunar lips. Yeah. There's you with your, with your titties out on show. <laughs> I've seen Kimmy like that in the shower before. What do you reckon? Like you wouldn't even be allowed to get up and sit on that, but it's a seat. Why would you want to sit on it for? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just... Kimmy's got her binoculars on. Look at this. He's now. Tell me, guys, this is not stupid or what? Kim's still got her binoculars on. Look, tell me how stupid it is for crying out loud, guys. Just tell her. One area. And you reckon, you reckon she's got problems putting up with me? Well, does that not say at all? You got knickers spread all over the place everywhere. I've just seen them come flying off that pan. <laughs> Kimmy, are you there? <laughs> Maybe I could swing off the pan. <laughs> That'd be fun. Yeah, that's weird. That'd be fun. Well, it was time to leave Ebor Falls, which you've seen in chapter okay, 12. Go. What's this little town called? Oh, Ebor. Ebor. 50 kilometre streets. So this is the town of Ebor, and it was Ebor Falls. That's it there on the picture, guys. You couldn't quite <laughs> see it like that. But anyway, once they fix it up, it will be um, a good area. Ebor is a village on Waterfall Way on the northern tablelands in New South Wales, Australia. It is situated about 80 kilometres east of Armidale and about a third of the way between Armidale and the coast. Ebor and the surrounding area had a population of 160. There is a post office, fuss spots, coffee shop, cafe, fuel station and shop. Also a motel and a primary school. There is a tourist information board located near the Ebor Public School. A little town of Ebor is there. Uh, anyway, upwards and beyond. What? Only waterfalls, but we can't see them properly. Ah. What sort of cow is that? Cow, babe. That's a bull, that one with the balls hanging oh. off it. Bloody hell. <laughs> That's a <the> massive bull. <laughs> you reckon that's a lover's arch? Oh, definitely. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it's got to be Lover's Arts, that one. Has to be. Rusty's calling it, so it is. <laughs> nice big valleys, aren't they? Yeah, they are beautiful. Look at that, guys. Absolutely glorious. The road just snakes its way up around in between it all. Step away from the comfort zone and be a little brave. So take a look around you. How far can you see? How far do you think you can run? Standing on your own knees. It's a beautiful world out there. Just don't pass on the dare. If you have the will and a moment to spare, it's a beautiful world out there. It's a beautiful world out there. It can be a bit frightening. Something you don't know You need a little enlightening It'll make you grow It's a beautiful world out there Just don't pass on the dead If you have the will and a moment to spare It's a beautiful world out there It's a beautiful world out there oh, It's a beautiful world out there Just don't pass on the dead Spectacular. 
it's pretty. Guys, just get a look at this view in a sec. Look at that, guys. Pretty specky. Yeah, pretty specky indeed. Absolutely beautiful. Welcome to Dorigo, guys. We've never ever been here before. No, we haven't. Have you gone through it? No, I don't think we have, have we? We will be stopping in here, grabbing a bite to eat or something. It is quarter to 12. Haven't had anything today yet, have we? Nope. To see which way is the town centre. Because we don't know because we've never been here before. Uh, here we go, this looks like a main street. Dorigo is situated on the Dorigo Plateau near the edge of the New England Escarpment above the Ballinger Valley. It is a quiet rural service town surrounded by rich agricultural lands which were predominantly used for sheep and cattle. The area is noted for its large number of waterfalls and bush walks. Its location on the edge of the escarpment results in a number of impressively panoramic views across the Ballinger Valley. In keeping with the district's long tradition of timber, cutting most of the streets in the town are named after timbers, thus cypress, mahogany, ash, tallow wood, rosewood, hickory, myrtle, carrion, and so on. Right, stop, yep, and just straight right, back. Right. <laughs> straight back virtually, yeah, babe. Just take it out of here. Straight back. Well, any time. Oh, hang on. What's wrong? Nothing. Well, you couldn't find reverse. <laughs> Keep going, you've got to go all the way back to your stop. Just straight like you are, and you'll hit a concrete plinth. Oh, for fuck's sake, don't let me do that. Keep going, Keep going. No, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Get out. She had trouble finding a reverse, guys. I don't know why, but anyway. <laughs> My reverse wasn't working. The reverse wasn't working. Go figure. Oh, I think he lives here. He's going to the hardware store. I think he lives in here. <laughs> Where are we? Dorigo. And we're chasing a bloody rooster up the street. Oh dear. He doesn't realise everyone's awake. He's doing his cock a doodle do you thing. <laughs> so it was time for some lunch at Components Cafe on Hickory Street. And what a great little cafe this is. With viewing out the window, as you can see, old Rusty there enjoying himself. But we did have a great feed. You're a fucking mess, good. Clean yourself up. I know. I've got no Clean. makeup on. No makeup, no nothing. It's these little country towns. Why? What do they do to you? Well, they just make you not care. Just relax. Oh, Jesus. You spend half an hour putting makeup on. Oh, Jesus. So we just had a bit of lunch here at Dorigo, didn't we, babe? We did. Very nice burger. Yep. A nice little country town in the boat. Yeah, it's not a bad little town. Don't forget to stop at the stop sign. Okay, my darling. <laughs> the hospital there too, babe. Is there? Hmm, just there on the left, that's a hospital. Oh, right, yep, yep. Right, go. Straight ahead, babe. Is this the way we would have been coming? Yep. Okay, so we will continue on to Nambaka and Nambaka heads. Beautiful area. Yeah, it's pretty here. It's very it? pretty. I like those pretty flowers. They're the billies or something. All right. Yeah, I don't know what they are. That's what they look like, don't they? Well, this is a long, steep descent for 11 kilometres. So. Yeah. Oh, we've got a bike behind. Here yeah. We go past, dude. Yep, yeah, he's coming past. He's going to try and go past you. Buddy. Okay, so we're coming down a Dorigo Mountain. Mount Dorigo is a Bible. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Some of these sport bike rides, they just race through here, don't they, babe? Yeah. Me Fresh myself. Stone. <laughs> I'd rather just take me time. Babe. You miss all the beautiful scenery if you rush through here. Yeah, bloody oath. Oh, this, this is absolutely beautiful though. Oh, wait till you see the views here in a sec, guys. <laughs> oh, I don't know. 
going to crumble. Oh, you can't see properly, guys. But, oh, oh, over the edge, yeah. Mm. Jesus. Mm. I would like to go over the edge. Just don't look at it or you end up going over it. Oh, no, I've got to look, babe. <laughs> it's like coming through our gorge, isn't it? It is, yeah. But, but you can see more. Mm. Yeah. So our gorge is just too thick with trees. Oh, look at that, guys. Hope you can see that. <laughs> Beautiful. You won't hear much from Kimmy. She'll be concentrating back there. I'm concentrating, yes. So make sure you're using your back brake, won't you? Don't ride it too much, Joe. <laughs> no, I am yeah. using my back, yep. Use your gears. Yeah, I am. One lane. Well, I'm using it. Well, that bike didn't get too far ahead, did he? Nah. <laughs> no one coming? Uh, can't see anything. No. Nah. Look, this guy, there's waterfall just there coming down. That's it. Right there. Sherrod look Falls. Oh, look at the view. Spectacular. Oh, I know, guys, I keep saying that, don't I? But come on, jump on board, guys, because it is. It is waterfall way. Another one lane here, too, babe. Yeah, I see that. <laughs> Going around the side of a mountain. <laughs> What's coming up? He's got his lights flashing. Ah, oh, I think he's just a workman, but it's a caravan coming. Look, that guy's out through there. Look, mm. spectacular. Are you ready to go, babe? Yep. <coughs> New Falls. Where's the falls? Oh, there on the left. Yeah. Oh yes. Hmm. Yeah, that's the one I said was near the road. Yeah, there's a couple come down like that, isn't there? Yeah. Imagine during winter how much they'd be gushing down. guys this is the third set of roadworks yeah got a few landslides and everything down through there haven't they yeah this road's following the river here guys at the moment has been for a while there's this big old building here guys like Kim said it's right on the side not this one on the right here although that's right on the side of the hill too this one up on the left just here this one here it's this big old house Look at it, it's just sitting on the side of the hill there. Three or four storeys, that is. Nice. Well, I bet that used to be splendid. Mm. Old place. I well, still living in it, people are, but yeah. What's this Belmont, is it? Uh, Bellingen. Bellingen, known to the locals as Bellow, is an attractive township in the heart of the Bellinger Valley, surrounded by rich pasture lands. It is a town which historically serviced the surrounding dairy farmers and timber cutters. Over the past 20 years, it has become a popular inland retreat from tree changers who do not want to live on the coast. The changes are obvious. The menus in the cafes have a distinctly citified feel about them. The shops have lots of homemade craft items. It's located 520 kilometres north of Sydney. We've just left the waterfall way and um, now we're on the Pacific Highway, the M1. We'll be going down here for about 20 kilometres, then turning into Nambucca Heads. But oh, what a beautiful road that was, wasn't it, Bo? Oh, yeah, I'd do that again. Yeah, from Armada all the way through to here. Beautiful. Welcome to Nambucca Heads, guys. For many people, particularly holiday makers and retirees, the Bucker Heads is about as perfect as any place can be. It was not for nothing that the local visitor guide once described it as God's country. 
The average temperature is 19 degrees in winter and 27 degrees in summer. The lazy subtropical climate is complemented by leisure activities including fishing, walking, boating, swimming, surfing and sunbathing. The town is located on a ridge which runs out to a headland which rises 26 metres above the Pacific Ocean at the mouth of the Numbucker. We really don't know where we're going, so we'll just follow Henry, won't we, babe? I reckon that'll be the best bet, because we don't never been here before. Nah. Oh, look at the ocean over there, babe. Yeah, it's a pretty beach. I was looking at the signs on the way in, it yeah. looked really pretty. It looks very pretty. Yeah. It's like a very hilly place. It's only just up around the corner here, sweetie. Yeah. There it is up there. I would say 100 metres. Oh, on, the right. on the right. Yeah, we got to go in on the right there, babe. Yep, yep that's it. Oh, you can go, turn right. Go watch that car. Yeah. <laughs> i got to watch this car too. Oh, fuck. Be very careful coming in through there. Yeah. I just bottomed out. Right. Be very careful. Pick your line, babe. Could be a while. I've got fucking traffic coming. Yeah. Come in on the angle. Straight at me from there. And take it easy. Take it easy. Come in towards me. Yep. We are at a great motel tonight. We'll go and see where Kimmy is, eh? Stop. Kimmy! Stop. Kimmy, Stop. where do you think I'm at my hotel? Ah, I like it. What? I can see bits through this glass here. I just here. don't like the people that come with it. Which people? <laughs> Rusty shouldn't do that to her, should I? She do not like me. She said she doesn't like me. Okay, so we are in a very beautiful place tonight, aren't we, sweetie? Yep. This is our motel here. Miramar is it babe or Miramar. is that an N on the egg? No it's an R, Miramar. Uh, Miramar. Yeah. And look, <laughs> how lucky are we? <laughs> We're right <laughs> next door to a liquor legend mm -hmm. and an RSL club. Yep. Fancy that eh? Oh, us, no. us. What are the chances <laughs> of that? <laughs> Bloody great eh? Apparently we've been told yeah. the main street's up around the corner here isn't it babe? About 150 metres. Yeah, so where's the bottle shop in there? Through the RSL, see? Liquor Legends entry via RSL car park. Right, okay. What are we? Monday, Tuesday? I'm just looking at them specials. Oh. Tuesday night and Wednesday night, they got specials. What are we, Monday? Oh, we're fucking Monday. Are you Come sure? On. Yes. We are Monday. We're Monday. Anyway, we'll go in there and we'll have a look. We might have to stay two nights, might we? Yeah. Yeah, just to get a Tuesday night special. That's right, we'll get a snitty special. Yeah. Very hilly place here, look. Yep. We are going to go for a walk down that way later, right down through there. I don't know how we get down there yet, but we're going to work that out. We'll take a shortcut somewhere. Babe, no. I found an anytime fitness for you, straight across the road. Now's not a good time, babe. No, anytime. They said anytime. So, where you go, no, I'll pick no, you up no, after no. I've had a couple of schooners. No, now is not A couple of points, a couple of schooners, and I'll, we'll be right, won't we? I'm walking up a hill, that's enough fitness. So apparently this is the main street up here. We're at the top of the street now, aren't we, babe? Main street. Let's just look out. What's all that in front of the cop shop over there? Look, all that around the edge here, around the bottom I of that know. fence. I don't know. We'll have to have a look at that. Yeah. We'll go this way first, and then buck ahead. Shopping complex, isn't it, sweetie? Yeah. So we'll go down, have a little wander about, and see there's something very interesting across the other side of the road over there, isn't there, babe? Mm -hmm. Bit of artwork in front of the police station. Of all places, eh? Of all places. They probably you, did it. You can't desecrate the cop shop. They probably did it themselves. Ah, oh, well. Golden Sands Tavern. Now, that sounds good to me. <laughs> it sounds like a nice place Anything to have a Anything with a word called tavern in it. <laughs> it sounds good, don't it, babe? Yep. What's the time, babe? Is it stubby time? Um, yes, it is. What's the time? Three o'clock on holiday time. We're a bit late today. Yeah. Local liquor. Local. I'm not carrying it all from all the way back up here, but not when we've got one next door, I'll pay full price. Right next door. So I don't have to carry it. Yeah. And when we run out, we can just pop back next door and get another one. This is actually fast. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we're doing. No flies on us, is there, sweetie? Mm -hmm. Right, so we've got to find somewhere to eat. Probably <laughs> I reckon that. we've already found that mm -hmm. right next door at the um, RSL because we don't want to walk up the hill again, do we, babe? No. no. This is, we're getting everything out of the way uptown here now, today, right now. Uh, I'm off with the camera. Look. 
She's I fucking awful, okay, okay guys. Don't you worry. I don't know if you'll be able to see. She's it. off. Um, I know how to get a good shot. You've actually got to talk to it while you're filming. I have been. I'm showing him the big hill. We're going to go down there later, flat out. Or go and hide. Rusty's up here taking pictures. She comes. She's got me. She's got me. He loves going into new towns. You coming, Kimmy? Here we go. And the cars are waiting. Because it's a crossing. Yeah. That's why the cars are waiting. Okay. Where are we off to now, Rusty? I don't really know yet, babe. To that tavern. Look at him. He's on his way to that tavern. What do you got, Kimmy? Where are you? I'm over here. Got a over here. Up. Where are at? Where are we, babe? Some tavern. Some tavern down in the main street of Nambucca Heads in the boat. Yeah. Was it the Sands Tavern? Golden Sands, babe. There you go. So look, Golden Sands Tavern, look at This is it right here. Nice and cool here in the doorway, isn't it? Yeah. Very cool, and that's the main street. Right there, having a stubby. First yep. one for the day. Okay, so this here is outside the police station. The Nambucca Mose Walk is a creative public art project that winds its way along nearly 60 metres of the footpath in Nambucca Heads, near the local police station. The project was led by artist Sky Crosley, who, with local artists and volunteers, scoured the district for distinctive tiles, pottery, china, and other knickknacks to create this spectacular artwork, capturing the maritime essence of the area. Its crazy patterns and mosaic work features mythical creatures plus dolphins, fish, a great octopus coming out of the waves. What does it say? In Nambucca, that's a big snake, babe. That's a snake. Yeah. yeah. Look, it's not bad, is it? That's pretty cool. It's all mosaic. Very, very impressive indeed, actually. It's, it's just with all different bits and pieces. That's why I said mosaic. It's a seat. That's why I say mosaic. No, but it's like rocks and it's got shells. It's got everything it's in got it, isn't it? It's got a plate. Pretty rad, that, actually. Look, a road. Look at this. A road going up through here with little cars. It's just a seat. And everything. It's a seat. Yeah. You've said that about a dozen times now, go. Hey, what do you reckon it is? <laughs> what do you reckon it is? Pretty. Do you reckon it's a seat? Shut up. <laughs> this is you. What? Freaking banana. A banana. That's you, look. Our Louvre lips. Yeah. Hey? <laughs> look, looks like my little cars on my bedspread. Yeah, I just showed them that. Oh, did you? Yeah. Okay. It's not bad, is it? Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh, babe, there's you with it. You have your titties out on the show. <laughs> I've seen Kimmy like that in the shower before. What do you reckon? Bloody well done, isn't it? Oh, babe, look at that. That's like it's got teeth and everything. It's like a crocodile. I think that's what it is, a crocodile, babe. And these here, guys, these are cups, broken cups, mugs, all them. And that's um, just a scrubbing brush? <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Pelicans, everything there. It's a lot of work in it. It's More work good. in there ever. There's a killer whale there, babe. Yeah. We wouldn't be able to have this back in Tassie. We're in a nanny state back there. I oh, know. They'd, they'd say those edges are too sharp. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah they'd yeah, say they're yeah. edges. Oh, look at the octopus. Because we're in nanny state, aren't we? Oh, we are. Like, you wouldn't even be allowed to get up and sit on that, but it's a seat. What would you want to sit on it for? I don't know, I'm just saying. Oh, fuck, I know. Uh, just... This was supposed to be a proper thing, babe. I'm asking for a friend. And you've all. gone to the gutter. Well, that one. Yeah, that looks good. That's a shark there, babe. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty cool. Some other towns can learn from this, can't they, yeah, babe? Yeah, it's a hey, hey. fancy cop shop, really. Yes, upwards and beyond. We're going to go to Woolies on the way to get a couple of drinks. No, not alcohol drinks, a couple of... Uh, probably water or Powerade or something like that, aren't we? Water. Oh, look at their old telephone, uh, uh, old telecom <laughs> thing. All been done up. They paint everything here. Yep. Okay, cool. guys, how you going? We. Oh, I've got to take my glasses off. I won't be able to see a thing, babe. Kimmy's got her binoculars on. Look at this. Is, now, tell me, guys, this is not stupid or what? She reckons she can see better like that. You can. I tell you what, if she can see better like that, I and not going to let her follow me on the bike, I can tell you <laughs> right now. Well, look at our views for the night, guys. Look at this. Stunning, isn't it? We are at Nambucca Heads. Where's the whale, babe? Where? 
Where? Where's the whale? Out here. They're breaching. They are there, yes. There are some whales breaching. Uh, see where the heads are there? Just over the back there, there was a heap of whales there breaching a few minutes ago, weren't there? Oh, there's one. I just seen it. But we are in absolutely beautiful surroundings tonight, aren't we, babe? Yes, we are. We've never been to Nambucca Heads before. Right. This is our motel complex. This is just the little... Oh, look at it. You would have seen that on the camera from here. That was a massive breach. I doubt it. Not on the GoPro, babe. Ah. But this is our accommodation for the night. This is the barbecue area. We're sitting down, of course, having a couple of drinks. And our room is... It's uh, one of the ones up there. We'll show you later. Very nice surroundings, isn't it, guys? Look at that. If it's just my luck, a coconut will come down and land on my bloody head. Kim's still got her binoculars on, look. Tell her how <laughs> stupid it is for crying out loud, guys. Just tell her. It she reckons she can see out there better like that. It actually that. works because yeah. it takes all that surrounding yeah. away and yeah. it just makes you focus on that one area. And you reckon, you reckon she's got problems putting up with me? Well. Does that not say at all? I have a stigma, you know. Got a stigma, it's called fucking game. <laughs> it's called game. <laughs> all right, look, I'll show you. The Good room. afternoon, little Kimmy. How Hi. are you? I am fantastic. We are having a ball today, aren't we, we sweetie? Are, yeah. We've come across Armadale and come across through Dorigo, the waterfall way. And I tell you what, what a splendid. Ride, it was it, beautiful. It was absolutely a fantastic yeah. ride. A couple of the waterfalls on the highway, they weren't flying a real lot, but they weren't too bad, were yeah. they? Yeah. We've never done it before, but boy, we've proved ourselves to luxury tonight, haven't we? We are at Nambucca Heads. Look at our views. Look at this, guys. Yeah, beautiful. Wait a minute, I'll just pan around. Absolutely fantastic. I'll tell you, we've been sitting down here. This is the barbecue area, isn't it, babe? Yeah. We've been down there, and out through there are the heads, and we've been watching whales, haven't we, babe? How many whales does Rusty get to watch all the time? This one. Yes. <laughs> but we've been watching whales out there at the heads mm -hmm. all afternoon. Mind you, we might have had one or two drinks, maybe. I've lost count. <laughs> Yes, well, that's true. That's I've lost true. count. But anyway, we've had a ball all the time, and haven't we, babe? Do you know what? For this million dollar view. Million yeah, dollar view? We only paid. 145. Yep. 145. The we're in, best. Where value are we? Nambaka Heads. It's the yep. best value room we've had yes, on this trip. Yes, never been here before. So, anyway, so as you can see, there might be a couple of beverages going down. A couple of bevies? They might want to know how the doll, Chucky the Bride, oh, travelled today. No, nah, she was sick. She was sick last yep. night. If you remember last night, she was spilling over the toilet, yep. wasn't she, babe? Yep, yep. Well, that's her today. Yep, she's been in bed all fucking day. Can't move her, can you, Oh, babe? she's took her sunnies off. Yeah. Well, fix her up, babe. Oh. That's our shitter and our toilet and everything in there. She's had her sunnies on because... And this, look, this is our living room. Clean yourself. My God. Well, turn the lights on. Oh, babe! What? What are you doing? You got knickers spread all over the place everywhere. I just seen them come flying off that pan. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Is that what happened? Yeah. What did you do? Well, I don't know. You've got your knickers spread out. You must have been using it as a dryer, were you, babe? Did you just go flick them up over there? Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> that looks like fun. <laughs> you know, don't you do that. Don't you do it. Well, we have, got, we have got a good apartment tonight, haven't we, babe? Eh? Anyone wants to come down and say hello, Kim McGrath, we've got a spare bed. It's and we've got a spare bed in there, too. It's if a you house. Like to kick, if you'd like to kick Mrs Chucky out, and, babe, go out that door. Oh, go yes. out that door. Look, yes, yes. I'll show you something. We've never had this before. Kimmy, oh. are you there? <laughs> <laughs> we've got two doors, man. Two doors. You see that? Two doors. Two doors. We're absolutely wrapped up, we both. It's a big house. It is a big house, yes. this one, isn't it? Eh? I like it. Yeah, it's yeah. not bad. Mm. So we've got all the mod cons telling everything, so don't worry, guys. And yep. we've got Kim's makeup bag. Uh, nothing in there. Nothing, though. okay. Nope. Yeah, she's hiding things well these days, isn't she, yeah, hey guys? Yeah. Hiding things. But anyway, we are heading towards Newcastle Way tomorrow, aren't we, both? Maybe I could swing off the fan. <laughs> That'd be fun. 
You're going to swing. That'll be fun. Fuck sakes, you won't even do anything with me in there and you're talking about swinging. Ah, oh, well, you know, yeah. things might lead up to things. Yeah, well, I think she's talking without Rusty and myself, guys, but anyway, not to worry. Um, we're just going to sit back and we're just going to enjoy the night. And we've got... You would never guess how we lucked it, though. Bottle shop right next door in there. Mm -hmm. Fucking RSL, right want? next door. What more do you want, yeah. eh? What is it called? Maramar. Motel Maramar or something rather where we're at. Yeah. Yep. RSL, right next door. Mm -hmm. Bottle shop, right convenient. next door. Yeah, very convenient indeed. Mm -hmm. Anyway, we've got to go. And we've even got some friends. Yes, we've got friends, yep, we're yes. meeting up with them later at no. the RSL, maybe. He talks a bit much for me. They're like fucking 90 year old or something. Yeah, they are about 90, but he's retired, but he talks a bit much for me. They don't do YouTube. He though. almost talks as much as you, and that's a bit much. Mm. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, okay. we've got we to gotta go. Say bye. goodbye, babe. Goodbye, babe. See ya. Bye. Now my wheels in motion.